woke up quick at about noon. Bitch, crowd gotta be in North Memphis soon. Woo! I live with my shit, nigga. On that ice cube, today was a good day. Boys in the hood, I always hard. Come with that high price, shit gon' get rough. No nothing in life but to be legit. Don't quote me, boy, cause I ain't said shit. On the hustle. Yeah, yeah. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy TDK, and I'm bye bye headed to our conference championship. I want y'all to check this out. Check out my team, and then check out this the uh, the commentator and what he has to say. Our two tickets to the Super Bowl. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the Madden Ultimate Playoffs. Up next, the winner goes to the Super Bowl. It's the conference championship, and it ought to be a good one between the Arizona Cardinals and the Tennessee Titans. The cards interplay here this afternoon one win away from a Super Bowl berth. They've overcome all sorts of obstacles just to get to this spot. And now it's time to see if they have what it takes to compete for the ultimate prize, the Lombardi Trophy. So, as you can see, we got a message from this clown, another clown complaining about players, talking about 15 legends, and I doubt I have 15 legends on my team. But even if I did, what difference does it make, man? If you don't stop complaining about teams out here, bunch of crybabies, man. Hashtag True Team and Hashtag True Team Ladies, how you doing on this beautiful Wednesday, Shouted? What's poppin' with you? We are in the conference championship. If the uh, if the person who was sp speaking, if it's right, we're both in our conference championship. So somebody's not going to the Super Bowl. And it ain't about to be me. You already can tell they about to be me. Especially if you sitting there complaining about teams. And look at Chris Johnson throwing folks off him, though. Doing his things. Marcus Mario is bringing this team to the line. Looking to make this pitch to my dude Michael. And we get maybe a yard or two out of it. Nothing crazy. I don't. Yeah, it's second day. So I'm trying to spin and then try to get up the field. And we get like maybe. A, so actually, we didn't get anything on there. And look at this. Stupid heat seeking tackling. So unfortunately, I end up getting stopped. Now I got to kick the field goal. And I'm kind of tight. Because I'm like, come on, man. Archer should be able to easily get to the outside, get in that end zone, and keep it pushing. But no. Of course, the stupid heat seeking tackling happens to kick in. It has to kick in just to help some of these clowns out. Because you know EA. They love to help out their babies. They don't like to help out the, the, the grown chickadees. You know what I'm saying? The folks that, the birds that can just jump out the nest and start flying. It's the mother lovers that can't fly. It's the, man. EA stay helping out their nut ass customers. Nonetheless, man, second and five. This fool's just running around with his chicken, like a chicken with his head cut off. And somehow, some way, he does end up making a play. Making something out of nothing. Right here on his first and ten. Because we pretty much stop him in the backfield. I mean, we get him stopped in the backfield on this play. But on the second, on the first play, he did get four yards out of it. Coming out his third and eight, he does hit his tight end on the post route. Looking kind of good, but luckily my boy, Marcus, not Marcus, my dude, Michael Kidris, he's definitely in that backfield causing havoc. I stay in that backfield, my dude, Michael. And then on that second and 14, he does get a nice game. Third and third is he thought, he thought he was going to make moves with that quarterback. Nah. Nah, you ain't running butt neck and wild on my team. But look at this BS. Watch this. Really, EA? Different rules for different people, bro. I swear for God, if that was me, y'all would have easily, easily allowed my big dumb ass to get picked off. I promise you, I was holding down Y. I was stressing the hell out of that Y button. Because I knew EA's trifling behinds wasn't going to look out for me. Like, how am I standing right there and I don't pick the ball off? I would have at least settled for at least a knockdown, but it's okay. Because my boy, Rashad Perryman, it's time to get that end zone, bro. I hope you got your rest because you ain't done. You're not going to be done. You got some more work to do. But before that day now, you know about this trifling life. And this fool's just lagging his ass off. I don't know if he's lagging or he's lag switching. Probably both. She can't hold down a connection. I can't even call it. But what I do know is, Perryman, you're not done, bro. You got some more running to do. But I got to get the ball back first. Right here on the second and ten. As he's dropping back, and then we get a stupid knockdown. Yay for us, man. I, I guess we don't, need, we don't need two hands no more. One hand is just fine. You know what I'm talking about? We don't need two hands to catch the football. Odell Beckham, he just set a new standard. You know what I'm saying? A standard that only you only need one hand. Fool, you is not Odell. Catch it with two hands, baby. That's why you play defense with your sorry ass. Damn. 
Pokey, your phone get like, hey, it's real. You're killing me, small. I hate this game at times. You know what I mean? Making me so mad. Nonetheless, on the second and hate <laughs> as he tries to go down the field. Day and night, not day and night, you know, when in doubt, you might as well throw the favor out. Luckily for us, we do get a knockdown, and then he does hit his tight end up the field. Coming up on his first and tens, he's running a little play action, and we end up getting the backfield. So I'm feeling pretty good. Coming up on a second and 15, we end up getting my boy D. Burks coming off the edge to get a sack on the play. Second and 22, I mean, not second, third and 22, third and long. As we do finally get a tip pass, we do get the interception. My boy, Rob Woodson. Breaking tackles, look at all kinds of good, and then we go to super weenie route. We just get down, because I'm not going to let you knock out my safety. I'm not going to let you play with my safety like that. But what I am going to do is send my boy Perryman on the fade route and keep it pushing. And guess what else we going to do? Guess what else we going to do? Get your fuck ass style on, boy. Hashtag excuse my French, y'all. I'm just saying, look at my boy Marcus Mario over here. No, he like, bro, we going to bite to the ship. We going to bite. We're going to make it happen, Captain. We're going to scissors before we do that. So we can go ahead and get our eat on. We already know childish play. Because, you know, he was either lagging or, or, or lag switch. Whatever he was doing, bro. You know you ain't got no pancake mix, though. Until later until later on in my second video. It's been real. It's been true. It's your boy, TDK. And I'm out.